Welcome back and today we have this two dragons one ounce fine silver coin and here you can see this very nice looks like the the battle of the dragons with your with the Chinese dragon here and the Welsh dragon here and separating them is the yin yang symbol and it's interesting that the in china the chinese dragon represents like longevity and good health and prosperity and then you have the Welsh dragon which is depicted as like uh, being a like a villain almost and how the two different cultures view the mystic dragon It is reeded. It's kind of hard to see with this capsule. So it is a reeded coin. And then you have the queen. I do like the security feature here on the field it gives it a nice unique look to it and probably very hard to counterfeit very nice details especially on the the crown And another thing that kind of stands out is that you have the two here, the two pounds. And then on the other side, you have the word two here. So maybe a first of the twos. It does come in this capsule and I do have to say that this is a, a highly high quality manufactured capsule but the only th the only thing that that uh, I don't really care for is the coin is a little over 38 millimeters in diameter and so it's a just a tad bit small for this capsule so you can hear it shake so it's just a a little loose not not bad but it would have been nice if either the capsule was just a little bit smaller or the coin was just a just a pinch bigger to have the perfect fitting but other than that that's just a minor minor little nuance I guess you could say both dragons very high in detail and you can even see the sinuous and flexible dragon 
and even in the tail here so and that's how we should live our lives is to be flexible and and not have our problems in life break us because unfortunately we do encounter some unpleasant things so like the dragon need to be sinuous and flexible And then you have the dualities here of the yin and yang principle and and they say the yin and yang is like the good and evil so <laughs> I don't know which one would be the evil and the good so I guess that just depends on what side of the fence you're standing on but nevertheless there has to be a a equal balance so both dragons can live harmoniously and there you have it the tale of the two dragons and until next time, have a great day.